This week, across Ohio, cultural institutions are able to open to the public once more, but not everyone is immediately. COSI, for instance, is leaning on what they're known for, science, to tell them when it's right to open. For months, the halls and exhibits of COSI have been empty. When we're closed, we don't generate revenue. It's a big problem, so we, the board, myself, my whole team, want to open as fast as possible. But first and foremost is the safety of our guests and patrons and our team. With a PhD in immunology, Bertley has the benefit of understanding exactly what is going on with the COVID-19 pandemic and applying it to the decision to open COSI's doors to the public. We're really relying heavily on science. You know, what does the CDC recommend? What does the NIH recommend? What does the scientific and medical community really say about how we can best guess around how to be safe and secure, in our case, for the guests and families we love to serve? That means the public will have to wait a little while longer to enjoy exhibits like the dinosaurs and DC superheroes. When we open, we're going to have almost absolutely everything online. Um, our exhibits, a lot of our demonstrations that you see in the atrium, a lot of cool stuff. Our theater, however, that one we're going to keep closed for a little while. Bertley is most excited to share COSI's newest exhibit, something that was set to open just as everything was being closed for the pandemic. We have this fabulous exhibit on Cuba. I mean, and everybody knows how cool Cuba is, and most of us Americans don't get a chance to go to Cuba. Well, you come to this exhibit in Central Ohio at COSI, and you can learn all the wonderful things about Cuban culture, the history, and it's a really fantastic exhibit. Now, as soon as COSI is able to reopen safely, all of the exhibits you saw will be available, including the DC Superheroes exhibit. Technically, it is supposed to be over by now, but they have been able to extend it through Labor Day. Local for you in Columbus, Jason Aubrey, NBC4.